case on. Um, whereas the one that you've got is the edge on. Edge on so I think you can see a lot of the nodes over here. Mm. Can you point? Well, there's a few for the sweet spots as well from the. but also if it's a different species based on the structures of these clover leaves. For a cricket blade, you're looking for a stiff material to transfer all the energy from the player into the ball. So by having a stiff bamboo material, it's going to be outperforming the willow as the energy will be transferred to the ball at a better rate. It is much more sustainable and that's what our calculations suggest as well uh, in part because bamboo grows significantly faster and that means it captures carbon within its structure and the faster growth helps that as well. So interestingly bamboo is not a wood, it is a grass. Uh, and that presents part of the problem because based on current MCC regulations, uh, the blade of a bat needs to be made from a single plank of timber, of wood. Uh, so there would have to be negotiations uh, and discussions with colleagues, uh, with uh, uh, people from the cricketing community about this. No, it's, it's very interesting. Um, it's definitely a lot heavier than the bats we sort of generally use. Um, so hitting it harder, hitting it faster is a little bit more difficult than um, a regulation bat. 